Look at these borders. That's a cute, 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 cute. Germany. And our development is 3.1 thousand. See, I have more development than Matthias. I have 200 more development than Russia. You thought that MP games in my server are dead? Not even close, guys. This is the fourth episode of our cute Swiss campaign, which, as you can see, is already a Germany. And you might think, why is it already Germany? In the last episode of this campaign that you can find here, you were Swiss. Well, I had a sub for this one session. This sub had just one goal. Going for Germany. He just had to borrow some provinces from an ally and form it. That's what happens. And today we're gonna continue as this cute Germany now and see how much we can expand it. Also, before we start, you can go ahead and enjoy subscribing this channel to get notified of all of the future content. MP, SP, Victoria Free, whatever you like to see. Okay, so to show you how the country is looking. Our income is higher now 420. Uh, we've got quantity, economic, quality, religious ideas. Our uh, maximum power is 930,000, almost a million. And we have 574 sleep. Now, as we are soon gonna hit the points cap, I'm just thinking what to do because the next idea group to unlock is military. So I'm gonna wait to hit the admin points cap. Probably in a year or two, I'm gonna take the admin deck. And we're gonna start feeling uh, the next idea group, which is gonna be offensive. We need for more force limit for our amount of the lands because we are perfect Swiss like We have 106 provinces. And ideas, ideas of Germany are like this: plus 0.5 infantry fire, plus 0.5 artillery fire, reinforce speed, recover army morale speed. I'm just telling you right away, I wasn't doing these ideas. I didn't know these ideas are existing in this mod until two weeks ago. Then it's 5% discipline, golf cap, tech cost, idea cost. Infantry combat ability, movement speed, trade efficiency, caravan power, manpower, force limit, death cost, admin efficiency, production efficiency, gross produce modifier. And this Germany is also having uh, Imperial German Republic, which is I mean, traditionally militarization state, max absolutism, uh, yearly army professionalism, army dual game modifier, and Junkers equilibrium. And yeah, there is militarization, but remember, max militarization on this mod is 2 discipline. It's not 10, it's 2 percent discipline. Uh, why don't we boost our absolutism? Because absolutism is actually boosted in this mod. 69. We need more. Yeah, we'll take a lot of absolutism here, and we're also gonna take an absolutism from here, right? That was absolutism. It's max for the cultures, culture conversion costs, max absolutism promote culture costs. Please take it. Our absolutism is also increasing by itself, right? Ah, just one yearly, that's not much. What's this mission though? This is establish the councillorship. That's a cheaper advisor, which I don't need now. 420 income, 60 absolutes, yes. Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. For my allies, Pope and Poland. Yeah, truth to France is until 12 more years. Oh, yeah, there goes the alliance. But uh, I have, of course, uh, agreement on the borders. We're gonna take uh, whole Champagne and most of Bordeaux. As January, let's take this, 666 power points, and uh, we can go and unlock the offensive ideas. This boys, first, second, ugly Germany. How dare you! This is a beautiful Germany, considering we started as a cute small Swiss. Oh, you wanted Alsace Lorraine, but um, you went a bit far. No, I think he wanted to take Paris, and I didn't want to go any too far. As mentioned, I think like 20 times already in this session, we had a sap, I didn't play last week. Trade centers. Everything here should be upgraded, and it absolutely is. These ones are not upgraded, because this is not part of the state yet. Well, now it is. Tick. Tick. And this level 2 or 3? Yes, level 2 now. And the trade. We have a uh, main trade in Champagne. Uh, we are collecting Rhineland. Collecting in Vienna and collecting in Saxony. The good thing in this mod is that collecting in not your main node is not giving you as many minuses as it is in vanilla. So it's actually worth it in this case to do so. And even though we are doing that, we are having 150 income from trade. So it's fairly good. The first thing that we want to take here is either a siege ability, your absolutism, admin efficiency, or max absolutism. I don't need max absolutism as of now, it's 84. I would either go for yearly absolutism to keep growing this, or admin efficiency. I can just do go with this, 
Yes? And then you'll take this. Don't you want to build universities? <laughs> Let me show you something. This is my development map port. If it's, it's something is this yellow color, it's 20. Who showed the map? Francis AI. It died last session. We have Imperial, Imperial Germany. Ooh. We have no one to fight. I don't need to. Not this time. No, not this time. We, I, I don't have anyone to fight right now. Okay, we need a fort in this process. Stenbrink is gonna be a perfect one. Um, it's instead of card house. Oh! Oh no, card house not taking the place! I forgot about that. I need a fort in these terrains as well. This one should be updated. I think Anhalt is gonna be the best here. Instead of the workshop, because it's the tax meta uh, province. Increase leave spirit meta? No. It's nerfed to the ground, right? And on top of that, high ground is um, buffed. We have more max absolutes for this. We have more tax and we have manpower recovery speed. Why? Max absolute is also buffed, so buffed. So we're getting 10 discipline for 100 of it. Are we development? We're number 6, yeah. So only have 400 less development than this Russia. Russia? Germany. Germany, Russia. So it's just 300 development difference. Aren't you running out of provinces to death while Russia still has plenty? I'm not talking about the future, I'm talking about now. I mean, Russia always had far more development than me. And it was me in the last two shares sessions that got, got closer to him, not the other way around. That's the Swiss campaign. And people like always keep talking, Slavik, you are out of the provinces to conquer! You are gonna die! You don't have nothing to care and care! Yes, you said that when they had 20 provinces in Switzerland. Look at me now. The uh, manpower rank. You wanted to see the manpower rank. It's Russia 1.6, Poland 1.5, Punjab 990, and Germany 990. Poland has 1.5 because he has both aristocratic and quantitadias. That was the next currency form. And that's the last one. We have max absolutism or re election cost. And free policies. Reinforce Republican values, please. Yes. B E A beautiful. Oh, did you show the new world? I was showing that for a second. It's Aztecs, Aztecs, Atlantis, Kemet, Pueblo, and Madias. Oh, Madias is destroying Pueblo. They will divide up France. Is there an agreement? Yes, I'm taking southern part of Bordeaux and whole Champagne. Why is Spain not seeing French land? Because Spain also died. Spain is dying to Pope. Okay, so this costs um, 339, so soon I'll be able to take two at, the, at once. And let's go and finish the ideas. For that, oh, let's become the different faith actually. For that, let me cancel this. Take idea cost. Finish the ideas. Cancel the idea cost and take the production thingy again. Now, this one for free, like it matters. Why don't we go and death more? Find a bad province here, bad trade good, like for example this one. I mean, bad because I'm gonna death with admin a little bit, just up to 30. And better trade goods are as well. It goes, and one mil. Make it perfect. That's 25. And I don't have to do that anymore. Can you show us military quality comparison? No, I can't. It's a multiplayer. There's no such tab here. But I can show you my quality. Let's see the development without the colonies. 2.9 thousand Punjab, 2.7 Russia, 2.6 Poland, 2.4 Toto, 2.3 us. Look, that's the manufacturer's map mode. And that's the soldier's household map mode. That's the church's map mode. In most of these provinces, I can keep uh, both church and manufactory and the other ones. Remember, 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 remember. Man, look at this. See this? This is my development map mode. Yellow is 20. Yeah, there it goes. Now we are level 5 defender face. Now they ate the last uh, Protestant nation. So we should have even more manpower, right? Because level 5 is giving 20% manpower in the true faith prince, not 10%. Let's wait a month, tick. One 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 nine. One one seven one. That's not a big difference. 
Here I'm just gonna go for the admin efficiency. So take more from France. Uh, at the same time, Absolutis is already 40. We have card houses everywhere already. Let's build the rest of them. We have card houses in this one are not taking building slots. Which truth with? We just finished. Uh, it's uh, leader number one. Leader number two. Number three. Oh. Number four. Declare war. Only conquest of cleansing their heresy. It's more prestige for that. It doesn't really matter. But it's it's better to go for the conquest because uh, the promise that we're taking as the war goal is cheaper to take. Just do that. Or the forts of France. Why France has no forts? Using the wars meta. We can perceive them. Okay, so what we need here, of course, we're just gonna take our champagne promises here. Uh, Betty, which is a war goal. And some kind of good borders here. Oh, we need this trade center for sure. Something like this. 900 Admin Mana C. And let's death a couple of times. Yeah, that was expected. Don't worry about this, boys. You're supposed to attack. What about Coburg? Yes, one, two, one, two. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now we have uh, Hungary, Austria, not Austria, Hungary. Hungary, Austrian Empire. That's perfect. And okay, can take that off in as well. Oh, we just need to wait a little bit for that. And peace out France first. Start calling everything and cancel the rival. Oh, I I just got the princess back. Yeah, see. Let me just restate them. It's our development now. 2.7 thousand. See, I'm just 100 below Russia right now, not 400. I'll need to build forts here, more, more importantly. Where is the coring ending? Need to save some money for that. And some of these princes are part of my states. So I can simply do that. And get my absolute is higher. I think it should be like 50 already. 60 even. 63. I love how uh, promises with 16 development are <laughs> pretty much orange already. And the ones with 20 are, uh, yeah, just there is yellow. See, I have already some 30 development promises. Uh, do I have to keep this guy? He's 46 old and giving me national nurses. Try another new military guy. <laughs> Maybe you'll be better. Oh, he's 36. That's really better. What kind of bonus he's gonna get? Yeah, really for Brican tradition. That was so freaking worth it taking again. Hex. Because Regis is not only giving you the morale. 5% army recovery speed and 10% switch ability on top of that. And my morale of, like, I have infantry, I have, like, 35% infantry combat ability already, so great, I'm doing this, the, I'm doing the damage, but I don't have enough morale to keep the battle so long to do this damage. So, Regis is far more useful for us as a Germany, because it doesn't matter that I have infantry combat ability. I'll run out of the morale before I actually use it in, in this, I'll do some damage to my enemies. So, in my case, Religious is the way. And the war's coming. We'll see about that. Germany is ready to go and protect its allies. So if anyone, if anyone attacks one of our allies, we're gonna hard commit to have some fun. In the meantime, I have uh, like 300 of war score of provinces to take from... 300% war score of provinces to take from France. Or maybe 250. So I still have like plenty of expansion. We should death with mil points. Let's start diving like crazy. Uh, maybe it start with the points that do not have a hand. 20 alone, just a few. Let's start with this one then. Stuttgart. Harsh development. It's going up to 21. Uh, 20, sorry. It's up to date, right? Yes. yes. So maybe find a better trade goods. That wasn't the best one. Straubrook is going to be far better. With paper. It's up to 30. 
Now only with mil points. Mulhausen. And Sundgau. Okay, that's it for diving now. Uh, that's even more manpower, and that's how many death clicks we have already. 880. Oh, look. Um, we have maximum right now army professionalism. So, co generals costing me 11. We just take a few generals. Up to the limit. We have some better generals. And now I can go and slacken. Why slack at maximum power? Because my army professionals is increasing. Um, can't really show it here, but it's increasing like 0.3 yearly, 0.2 yearly. We will see that monthly it will increase like 0.01. Each month is increasing, so why don't keep it at 100%? percent month take 90.15, see? So why don't keep it at 100% where I can just slacken and get it to 100% again, then slacken and get 100% again. And slacken is 10 uh, army professionals in this mod, so it's nerfed a little bit. That's for me, Hango Austria, change your tech group to Western. I don't know. Next move, we still have all of these French lands to take. Uh, his ideas are definitely French. Calf combat ability, recover army morale speed, morale of armies, promise war, co war score cost, maximum power, um, discipline, reinforced speed, inflation reduction, interest per annum, production efficiency, admin efficiency, hedging, venom points, no uh, penalties, free policies, calf cost, and land leader maneuver. And it is turning it. Did someone say that at the start of the session when Rush had 400 more developers than us? Zlevik, Rush has far more lands than you to develop. He's gonna outscale the hell out of you. And two hours later, we are just four, having 40 development less than Russia. Yeah, I keep it in France. Uh, truth with France is ending in uh, four years. Oh no, he was 44 years old. Why? Let me declare war in France. And it's gonna be conquest of uh, Blois. That's defense from France, yeah. Just right here. Let's go on death. Zwick Breaker. This bit here. Get a death cause addict. Tick, 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 tick. Tick, 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 tick. tick. Gets it up to 30. Luxembourg. Ah, that's Luxem Luxembourg, but it doesn't have prosperity, so no, no Devink. False. I think it's the same state. Let's get up to 30 as well. We're out of Diplo points, so let's just focus with the mid points now. Constance. Up to 31. I think we can get to 1000 death clicks today. I said that we can't at the start of the session, but I think we can. Why 100 crownlands? Because crownland is boosted in the mod. You can see there's higher tax in, in, uh, than in uh, vanilla. There's manpower recovery speed, which is not in vanilla, and there's more max absolute, which is, I think, 15% vanilla. And also, absolute is, is boosted. At 100 absolute, you're getting 10% um, discipline instead of 5. So it's more worth it to go with the high crownland. Let's do this. Send offer. Look at these borders. That's a cute, 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 cute. Germany. Start coring now. And our development is 3.1 thousand. See, I have more development than Madias. I have 200 more development than Russia. Where is the guy that two, three hours ago said that Russia has 200 or 300 more than, than us and he's gonna outscale us in a couple of years. Where are you? Why are you outscaled Russia? <laughs> Max Taylor is still 100, it's, they're not increasing. Uh, my trade is fine, it's 220 ducats. It's really good. 604 of total income. You can compare that also with Poland if you want to. This is us, this is Poland. Right, this is Pope. This is Madias, I think. I could think about getting the maximum power state edicts. So let's see, I'm spending 24 on my state maintenance. And I think I have some modifiers for the state maintenance. I think I had, maybe I don't. But let's see, 25. And if I get the trade power everywhere. Not encourage development, trade power.
Okay. Now this is 1.5 million and this is 55 since 30 ducats. You're about to see a play war. Yes, that's official guys. Cannon stack number one. Cannon stack number two. Cannon stack number three. Oh, where's number four? Cannon stack number four. 80 care marks. Let's not go to that much over the limit. Let's from our access now. Death cost, cancel. Take the morale instead. Summarize 6 point. Is it update? 4? I guess it's 6.4. Which is the, should change the manpower guy into morale guy. What's my morale now? 6.8. Not bad. Can I get, just go south with my stacks? Re-elect, take the discipline, and let's go. So it's Toto, Kitar and Sasanian. So, if anyone is thinking it's a gang, like it. no it's not. Oh look at this, this fort has zero morale. See? He didn't pay for his armies, I think. I can go and establish the front line. Potato says he won't fight. Why? I don't know. Come on! I need content! Tell Potato. It's 2v versus 3! <sighs> Toto is fairly strong in this mod. I, I don't want to rush the forts, that's that's the thing. And also, I just can't go blindlessly for the forts, because if they come with 5-6 cannon stacks, I can just go and catch all of my reinforcements. You know what I mean, I just have 4 cannon stacks. Which is actually a lot, but can be easily countered. If I misplay. And we've lost half a million attrition. 5 minutes later. Oh, come on. Ah. <sighs> Three versus two, without a single battle, they just unconditionally surrendered. At least I got PP, so I have 60 PP now. I had zero. Yes, we are fighting three versus two. I have better numbers. Ah, screw it, I'm gonna unconditionally surrender without a single battle. <laughs> like, imagine this kind of approach. How many death clicks? Um, 900. 1000! Yes! Uh, we end. Free game in Germany. I look. I wanted to go to war. We attack two versus three, two versus three, and the Ankudushu surrendered without a single battle. Ugh. I hate it.